This is an urgent public service message from the Coast Guard, and I really hope that you pay close attention to it and do exactly what I recommend. Stay tuned. I did not realize that this was an issue until one of my viewers asked me to put the word out to everybody to get on board with this Coast Guard initiative. Do you realize that the Coast Guard wastes tremendous amounts of resources every year looking for boaters that are not lost? What, the, what happens is, is if they find a boat that's just kind of floating around, they have to assume that the boater has gone overboard and needs to be rescued. If they have to launch a helicopter, that's $4,000 an hour. If they have to use a boat, that's $2,000 an hour. And boats can come loose for all sorts of reasons. They can come untied from a dock. You could have your kayak on the beach. The tide comes up, picks it up, pulls it out. You're left screaming on the beach. Hey, where's my kayak? Well, an hour later, the Coast Guard's going to find that and think that you're overboard. Or a strong wind can come up and push that kayak or canoe back into the water. So to help the Coast Guard not waste resources, they're asking each of us to put one of these if found stickers on our kayak. Now there's a couple things to know about how to actually use and place the sticker. The first thing is, of course, it wants your name, but it also wants two phone numbers. And the reason for that is that if you're in the water, your cell phone's probably with you and no one's going to answer. At least if there's an alternate number, someone might be able to tell the Coast Guard where you were when you potentially went overboard or that you're okay. Now, the second thing is that they would like this sticker placed in a visible location on the inside of your kayak. So don't put it on the outside where the riding could get worn off. What I'm going to do is put it right here on the inside where it's fully visible. Now, the final step, once you filled it in and placed it, is they would like you to put some clear packing tape over it to, again, protect the writing from the elements. So there you go. Check out the email address below. That's where you can get one of these for free as long as they're available. Otherwise, you can go to Amazon and get the same thing for a couple bucks. <sighs> Let's everybody do this. You don't want to cause the Coast Guard to waste money when they could be spending all those resources on finding people who are actually in need of help. Thanks.